Hello, I'm Green Eyed Guide and this is Gala and today we're going to do a real quick review of Rockstar's Cucumber Lime Energy Drink. We're going to talk about who it's for, what's in it, and when, if ever, you'd want to drink this. So first things first, who is this for? If you are not a fan of Rockstar's original black cans or white sugar-free cans, then this might be an energy drink for you. This is Rockstar's crossover. This is their imitation of a hydration beverage or a sports beverage, hence the electrolytes. It's got what plants crave. This is not for people who are sensitive to caffeine, duh, or for people who are trying to cut out artificial sweeteners because this does have ACE K, acylfame potassium, ACE K is a lot easier to say, and that's what food scientists call it. Anyways, this has ACE K and it also has sucralose, but it does not have any artificial flavors or colors. It has natural flavors. Also, it only has one gram of sugar. So, what are the key ingredients? Obviously, this has caffeine, but it only has 80 milligrams per serving. Note that there are two servings per can. But if you only have one serving, like you're supposed to, then that's about the amount of caffeine in a Red Bull, or approximately the amount of caffeine in a tall mocha from Starbucks. This also has 100% of your daily value of niacin, vitamin B6, and vitamin B12. This also has 100% of vitamin B5, which is pantothenic acid, but if you've read my book on energy drinks, you know that no one needs pantothenic acid. Pantothen means everywhere, because vitamin B5 is in everything. So it's a little ridiculous when people... This energy drink also has milk thistle, which is good for your liver. They actually give milk thistle to people who have overdosed on poisonous mushrooms. And it also has ginseng, which allegedly helps a lot of things, like your brain. But a lot of those studies are inconclusive, just FYI. And finally, when, if ever, would you drink this? So as I said before, this energy drink only has 80 milligrams of caffeine per serving, which means, according to my five levels of fatigue, you would drink this if you were at fatigue level two. Remember that fatigue level zero is when you're happy and hyper and don't need any extra energy from any food or drinks. Level one is when you're tired according to, I mean, you're tired because of dehydration. So level two is when you actually need help from caffeine. So this could be a beverage that you reach for. Again, assuming that you only drink one serving like you're supposed to. So that's it. That's our quick review. I hope you enjoyed it and stay tuned for more. Okay, thanks. Bye.